Uh-huh. Talking about that, see you soon. You uh-huh. wanted to see somebody soon. Mm-hmm. We need to go into that. What's going on? So, you really thought we are going to do this interview without addressing it? <laughs> well, you have had somebody that you wanted to really see soon. I'm going to say his name. Notes. And obviously, you had your little um, rant on your social media where you banned him from Brum. You said he's not allowed to come to Brum and make money. First of all, I need to know, where the hell did that come from? Okay, firstly, I would like to say it definitely got taken out of context. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, it got blown out of proportion. Because, again... I mean, you came on smoke, though. I hear you, I hear you. But again, like, he's a human being, so... I'm only one man. No matter how many people I will claim to have on my chessboard or have in my army, there is just one me, you know what I'm saying? And he yeah. is just one person. Mm-hmm. So him coming into my city, I say my city, him coming into Birmingham, mm. no one can physically ban the person from coming into a city. Do you get what I'm saying? Now, me telling him, <coughs> you're banned from coming into the city, was due to a personal issue between us. Now... Are we going to go into it? What's this personal issue? I didn't want to... I didn't even want us to talk about this shit because it's going to be as if to say man's given him, like, even shedding light to this bullshit. But just so that we can address it and go past it quickly, I will just say, essentially... I was, I, I was, I, I must, he must have released the record on GRM Daily and I must have put a little cheeky comment like, oh yeah, this is shit, because this is shit, like, no, like when has Notes dropped a cold, a, a, a good record, a, like, it's, that error has gone, which is calm, like, because everyone has their error, like we were just saying, where they come and go, so obviously, I think he must have taken it personal, and then I get a phone call from a credible source, I'm not going to put her in not going to put her in a crossfire here. But I get a call from a credible source talking about, oh, yeah, your record, uh, your um, single Gucci that's coming out with Sneakbo and Lyco and all of these lot, they're trying to make sure it doesn't get premiered by GRM Daily. Notes is saying it's either you or him. I'm like, wait, what? So what you think, as a black brother, you're trying to use whatever influence you feel like you have to try and stop, like, even though th- this is from, even though it's something minor to him, or I don't know who, like, w- like what angle they were coming from, but how dare you? Yeah. How, like, yeah, you're telling me I can't, like, they shouldn't premiere my, you know what I'm saying? And obviously, mm. luckily, Jerem Daly are not biased. I don't even know if he even got to... The, the person who's in control, if the message even got to them, if you know what I'm saying. However, they released the song how it was meant to be, do you know what I'm saying? Mm. But for me, it's a matter of, yeah, you think you are in a position to ban me from GRM or ban me from in the scene in anything. Cool. You are not coming to Birmingham to make money again. And if you do, my friends will pay you a visit. Now, me saying my friends will pay you a visit, like... Again, people took that out of context. They felt like I was threatening him, saying that I'm gonna like. This is not. It's not no. Well, what do you mean about it's not like paying you a visit then if it's not a threat? <laughs> yeah, man. So <laughs> it's just one of those situations where I just felt like, especially because there was the whole bullshit of him prior. Telling artists, star, yeah, don't make that song with him. Don't make, don't release this record. That's already cost man money, like, and we address this publicly, and it's like, cool, whatever. Yeah. And then now, you then dare, because of I make a comment, you then dare try and use your influence to stop a release of, like, so essentially, that's, that's why I came out and said, okay, cool, you're banned from Brom. I definitely didn't think the blogs or anyone would care enough for it to become taken okay. out of a portion but obviously again you think about it but even it's, i think it's because the way you said it like if you're feeling froggy <laughs> jump like it was given very much i have a lot of power and i'm going to do anything in my power to stop your bag or stop you from coming to brown hey listen anyone can get touched and no one is invincible and yeah. i don't think i don't think i'm i don't think i'm anything special 
know what I'm saying? Yeah. I know that, yeah, God has blessed me, yeah. but hey, <laughs> like Omar, anyone can get touched. You know what I'm saying? Have you watched, uh, do you know where, where Omar, that reference is from? No. Cool, yeah, like Omar, anyone can get touched. Yeah. Those who know, they know what I'm talking about. So, yeah, man, I will. I don't think there's anything special mm. or, or it's just a matter of I am a man of principle. But don't you think like, you upset his feelings and have you ever just thought to just apologise? Because I, I, I hear what you're saying. I can't like, no, wait, wait, hear me out. Hear me out. I hear where you're coming from. He was doing a lot, like trying to stop your song with the GRM Daily, if that's true, allegedly. Mm. But... Also, if he respects you as a person and clearly he seems to respect your opinion and if you've then put your opinion publicly where you're, you're basically saying his music is shit, he obviously felt some type of way. Like, would you like it if you dropped a track and someone that maybe you respected dropped a comment like, oh, that's dead. Would you not feel some type of way as well? Because I'm seeing that that's kind of what it happened no. rather than he's just on smoke with you. You upset his feelings. Hey, you live for their reject. You live for their acceptance. You die for their rejection. Now, I don't live for anyone's acceptance. Mm. Like there is, if I release a record, I'm okay with everyone saying this is terrible. This is shit. Because but when I, everyone's different. I Some hear people... you. I hear you. So, but for, again, you just ask for my opinion. So, okay. in, in my opinion, I don't live for no one's acceptance because I know I will die for their rejection. So, I have the right to my opinion. And the same way he does as well. And I definitely would feel hurt if a person I rate commented on any of my posts to say this is shit. But hey, it would make me definitely go and work harder. It would definitely give me the motivation to say, okay, well, if it if he if he thinks this but is do shit. But you have his number? We're not that cool. Oh, like okay. there was def, def, there was definitely a period where we was on talking terms where I remember when I wanted to sign him to my but it, it, like that era was a very long time ago so we're not on talking terms where we like occasionally we might DM each other to troll each other you mm. know what I'm saying okay so it wasn't like one of those that you could have just messaged him no we're not on I think those that's kind what of terms. it is like because you need to understand like things like when you the blogs are so intense like I've been dragged a lot personally as well mm. and I think when you see someone that you have love for joining in the trolling mm. I can't lie you feel it I hear you I, I hear you it, I, I hear I you I'm not gonna be I'm not gonna be oblivious to it yeah because even when this happened the when the shade borrower picked it up People, you don't think people were troll? People were troll. Who is he to think he can ban anyone? Yeah, but you don't care about people you don't know. I'm saying, but that's what I'm trying to say. But like, don't think I didn't see niggas that I know that people that I rate bloggers. Uh, there's this one podcast. I'm never going to say his name. A f- actually, there was a few podcast niggas who I seen in the comments who I actually rate these guys. I actually rate their podcast. Actually rate it. It's like oh, fucking hell, you as well and. People are there trolling. Oh, look at him. He looks like he hasn't even brushed his teeth this morning. He's like, <laughs> how can you tell me I brushed my teeth or not? But yeah. it's, I actually had it. So he was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> he actually caught me. So, like, essentially, I, I, all of the people who were commenting, and it's like, oh, pff, hey, listen, say whatever. You know what I'm saying? I'm here. They're talking. So I can't even feel bad about it, if you know what I'm saying. So, yeah. but... Because I Any can't, like, who do when there's someone that I have known that's dragged me publicly on blog page, I'll block them. Because yeah. I, I, I can't deal with that. Like, what? I don't care about yeah, people yeah, I just... don't know. But if I know yeah. you, fucking message me, bro. Like, yeah. why are you in the comments, comments dragging me? Like, nah, I'll, I'll I just troll. leave them. I just leave them. I, if, I think it's more powerful when you don't even... When you know that they've done that and they don't know if you know if that they've done that. That mm. so it's down to me how I'm gonna act when I next see you. Oh, I can yeah. act like oh hey, yeah. or I can be like, you know what I'm saying. So yeah. hey, so do what you want, man. So bottom line, would you ever apologize? What it's what am I apologizing for? Because you call this music shit. And, and so am I not allowed to have an opinion? So I should apologize for having an opinion. DM, DM him saying okay. I apologize for having an opinion. I guess. Aren't you allowed to have an opinion? Are you, do you, must you like every music that comes out just because the artist is big? But you didn't have to say anything. I, if you true, don't have anything nice true, to say, just don't say true. anything. Some people can say you don't have to give your opinion and some people would say they want to hear my opinion. 
So there's two sides to that opinion that you just made there. Yeah. So we're never going to get an apology. <laughs> this is going to be going for a while now. Hey, I don't think I don't think he's looking for an apology off me. And plus, hey, listen, we're past all of that now. You know what I'm saying? That like mm. he 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 honored the he honoured the ban when he was banned. You know what I'm saying? He honoured it. He honoured the ban. I know he was trying to troll and put up put statuses like, oh, come in Birmingham now. You you weren't going to do that. Is it? You weren't. You weren't going to fucking do that. Is but it? essentially, allow all of that bad man talk because it's not even... Like, it's not, it's not that. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You opening your mouth and trying to use your power to block another black brother, you're like, you can't... You can't tell him how he's going to react and you can't expect him to... But I think you're being a bit hypocritical because you started this thing Go on. and then he's responding. It's just like you said in the beginning, Go on. people will paint you as the villain yeah. when you're reacting. Yeah. He's reacting to you. So, okay, so he, why, why, have I, he, why have I... Why do I originally have an opinion about his music being shit? <laughs> So you think, you about think it. he started it by making shit music? No, 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 no. That's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. How did he like... start it then? Tell me how he started it. I think you need to go back and watch the Katie Golden interview. What was that? Because there's even? like, because there, there's been a history. There's there's other. I, like, I hate the fact that we've all spent bare time talking about this nigga. But there's been a li- there's little shit that he's done in the past oh, okay. where he stopped. Me for making money, bro. Like, there's okay, you know so it saying? wasn't just that. In yeah, the... oh, that's okay. not the start of okay. that comment. There that's wasn't different. the start of our our whole interaction. Oh, then the start of our right. the, the start of our interaction was when me and Lotto Boys broke up. He's rang an artist who was doing a song with my Gambi me at the time okay. and told Donny I paid the geezer five grand to do a verse with the guy and told Donny I'm gonna use everything in my power to block this guy from what moving forward because I heard he finessed my friends not all boys at the time so on that basis he started to make calls to block man now we've come together we've squashed our beef they've come out and be like okay in all honesty that's not what happened he didn't mm. rob us but you didn't apologise for your opening your mouth and blocking me and stopping me from moving forward as a black brother. Yeah. So, obviously, I'm going to troll you. Do you know what I'm saying? I see you drop a shit song. Obviously, I'm going to say this is a shit song. Aren't okay. you the same guy who tried to stop me right. when I was down? Now I'm back. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm up again. I'm nice. Yeah. You are stressed. Okay. You got a mil from... Fer- and so I told him, you got a million pound from Ferdy. I got 100k, I'm a millionaire now, you ain't got 100 bags, bro. That's just the reality. You ain't got, you ain't got 100 bags, you can't show me 100 grand. I will, f- you, ain't got, you ain't got 100 grand. So, it's not, it's not a thing where I was trying to bully him. This was personal. Yeah. Like, you really tried to use your influence to stop me. Oh. Like, so, and then now, it's this, you don't have that kind of influence no more, bro. You're not in a position to do that. So yeah. is why I would troll you and tell you you're banned from Birmingham and if you come, you're, you're, yeah, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. like I've said, we've fallen that shit to, um, to bed now. Yeah. His people have uh, hit my people up. We had a conversation, spoke to some people who were allegedly... Because there's people who he, like, are, who he pays and all of that who are put for protection and all of that and mm. they've ended up hitting man up. And, my, and we've had a combo and it's like, okay... Everyone's like, hey, you know what I'm saying? So it's 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 calm it's calm energy for now, man. You know for what I'm now, saying? It's calm energy. Yeah. I feel like we need to move on from it now yeah, because man. you seem a bit <laughs> seems like you really wanted to clear that up. <laughs> but um 